All right. This is a this is a fun carving, and uh, again, this is a pretty nasty log. But um, this is an owl taking off in flight. What you do is you V-cut down the center of the log about halfway. This is a 30, 31 inch log and I'm cutting down 16 inches. You notice it's thick on each side. That ain't nothing. I'm just showing you. Then you come down and you V it in again and then you notch out for the head. You can see that I've done this right here. Then what you do is um, you shape the body and the head you and the feet down at the bottom. You cut out for the V for there. Now I'm showing you the back side of it. And on the back side, I do another little V cut. That's where his tail feathers are going to start. And I, I plunge cut all the way through now. I don't know if I did it on this owl particularly or not. But um, uh, I do these owls in power carvings in 15 minutes, uh, sometimes 20 minutes. Uh, just gives or takes how much detail you put into it. But anyways, now I'm just going to thin out in between the wings on the outside and the inside. And I'm giving you overall views all the way around where I'm cutting the body in and etc. And uh, then you're going to see in just a second that I'm going to start sanding the sides and shaping the wings more. And you can see how it went from that block look to more of a rounder look now. And there's the back side that I did. Here's the front side, and I curved the sharp points above his head where the wings turn and go back up. That's what I'm showing you in that picture. And then I'm going to do the same thing to the back side of it. Um, anyways, these are very simple carvings. They don't take long to do. Your first one will take a little bit of time, but then after that it won't take long at all. Now I'm doing a little section in between the wings and the back of the body and etc. And I've also found that these here look really good on like cypress or um, more exotic woods. They don't really look all that great in just oak like what I'm using, but they still turn out really good. It looks like there's a lot more involved to this than there is. Um, it's, it's very simple. It doesn't take long, and um, they're fun carvings. Now, you see, I'm just adding all the details to the feathers. Then, of course, like all my other ones, I come in and paint it black, and here's after I washed it down. Uh, I come in and paint it black, and then I sand it off. Well, no, I actually burned this one. I can't believe it. I thought I painted it black. So this one here is burned, and with a torch. Uh, we call them uh, yard torches or weed, weed torches. Anyways, hopefully you like this right here. Again, this is a nice, simple, fast way of doing it, and um, hopefully you enjoy it. I'm going to be putting out a lot more videos of these right here, and hopefully you enjoy them. Thank you very much for taking the time to look at it. This is how to carve an a, uh, owl in flight.